Welcome to another video and welcome to Alsasia, Cheshire and it was three weeks ago since we were there filming the lighting of the lights here in Alsasia. About town, we now come and have a little walk around, check out the shops, check out the decorations. Come and join us, hopefully you will. There's a beautiful uh, Christmas tree in the winter here at Bayfields. Look at that. How beautiful is that? Some lovely displays there with the glasses. All Sager does really, really well with the lights. It does look pretty stunning. So we're going to walk up through the village and we'll have a look at the Christmas tree. So about 11 days for Christmas. Can't believe it. December is flying by already. So tonight we're using the Osmo Pocket 3 low light mode and this should look absolutely stunning for you guys. Alec Ross carpets, nice Christmas tree up there. Quite a mild night, a little bit of uh, drizzle in the air. Just look how sad Bank Corner is looking across there. They're all uh, closed there. Beautiful decorations hanging there in the middle of the road. So we're going to head into the All Sages Civic Centre here. The community church. Just look at the decorations, beautiful. Now, in front of me, I've just spotted the All Sage Christmas tree. Spectacular. A lot better than last year. Hopefully, we're going to do a video of all the different Christmas trees around the area, but you know what? I think this one is going to be one of the best. Now this does look stunning. And there we go. Merry Christmas from Allsage. Got to admit, that does look beautiful. I'll say just Civic Centre. Lit up amazingly well. Got to say, all Sage, you've done yourself proud. That tree. Beautiful. We're looking there at uh, Bank Corner. There's a Merry Christmas sign up over 50s bar. That looks really well. There's Glenn also doing the filming tonight here at All Sage. To continue from uh, Norton Road up into Crew Road. Do you know what? Beautiful night. Look at the sign over 55 wine bar. Merry Christmas. So that's Bank Corner. Hip hops. Looks like there's plenty going on at All Sager tonight. So this is a Thursday night. Here at All Sager. It looks as though uh, Bridgeford's have got a really good Christmas display there. Latifs, quite a few people in Latifs. And just look at St Luke's of All Sager. Some beautiful Christmas displays there. Nice little dress. Let's check out this window. Plenty of toys. Okay, so we are going to continue. 
walking past Ashiyar Bolti, Indian takeaway on the right. And right in front of us is the famous vault. That was probably quite a few people in there tonight. Just looking at the displays in Stevenson Brown, ho ho ho. Latins are, well, Franklin from mortgages. They've got all these snowflakes in the window. So we're just passing the, the vault at the moment. There's nobody actually in the vault, which is amazing. Huh? Just passing Sainsbury's local. So we're currently walking up Crew Road. And to the right will be St Mary's Church. Milton Gardens over there on the left hand side. In what used to be the old police station here in Olsager. And there's a nice little house there, all lit up. Beautiful little Christmas tree. I wonder who lives there. Pretty spectacular. So this part is a little bit dull here. It's a shame that none of these guys have got any of the lights going on. So over in front of us is All Sage of Dental Care. And there's a new pub there, a wine bar called Bod. I haven't been in there, that looks pretty good. Always plenty going on in all stages. So at the top end of Crew Road, and there's a lot more Christmas light displays up here. I'm just going to pass the Mere Gardens down there. Lakeside Fish Bar. Always plenty of people in the Lakeside Fish Bar. All stage of food and wine. And over there is Mr. Biggs. All stage of delight. There's plenty going on here. Beautiful window displays. Wow. Okay, let's continue heading up to far end of Crew Road. We've got Flames Kebab House there, the Mere Inn. And you can see there Christmas lights. All Sage of Pet Stores, been there a long, long time. Decorations really, really are nice. Nice little place there. I don't know what that, oh, that's the side of the mirror. And we've got a Chinese takeaway here. Good display of the window. All the reindeers. Wow, just check out all the buildings there in the window. That looks pretty cool. You can see the Christmas lights. Rudolph, that looks pretty good. There we go, the barber shop. 
Perfect. All the eateries in Osage are very, very classy. Look amazing. Lit up at night. Indian Evan. That's basically quite a popular one. And then we've got Food Bay. Right, so let's cross over and we'll head back. So we're just passing um, Indian Evan here. All the restaurants are really, really busy around here tonight. Quite a few empty shops, uh, probably around this area. Well, not now, they're not too many. No, they're all taken. No, I'm wrong there, there's no empty shops. Oh, there we go, Santa on the toilet. Check out that cheeky elf. It's nicely dressed. Barry's Pantry, that's still here. Wow, when I uh, used to work at Old Sager, Barry's Pantry was always a really famous place to go for. It says uh, established 1986. Well, what a beautiful night to be walking through Old Sager with us. At the time of the year, it really is pretty mild. That's a mere inn that we're just passing. We've got flames here on the right hand side. All sage of food and wine. Lakeside fish bar over on the left hand side. Nice uh, decorations there above All Sage of Delight. And we're passing this new Bod Cafe and Bar. That looks a pretty impressive place. Looks really good. Titanic Brewery. Just a few more decorations here before we get to Milton Park and then we'll head back down into bottom part of Crew Road, Lawton Road. Still loving the Osmo Pocket 3 low light mode. I mean, just check this out. Something last year we wouldn't have been able to do is to film in low light like this. Awesome. So yeah, almost three weeks ago, we were here at All Sage filming the lighting of the Christmas lights, all the fireworks. It was packed along here. There was fun fairs, road obviously was closed. We had a great time. Make sure you check out that video if you've not already done so. Now, I've got to admit, this is a beautiful home. Just look at that. I wonder who lives in that home. Beautiful Christmas tree. Absolute credit to them. Milton Park. Ooh, wouldn't like going there at night. That looks a bit on the scary side. Beautiful Christmas lights around Milton Park there. Let's do a slow pan around the Milton Park area. So on Sunday, this weekend, we are heading to London, the big city, big smoke. And we're gonna walk down Oxford Street, Regent Street, Covent Gardens. And we're gonna bring to you guys spectacular Christmas decorations.
Anyway, back to Old Sager. Good view there of Sager's local. All lit up. Vault on the left hand side. One thing about Old Sager is very, very clean. And you actually feel pretty safe to, to be walking through here tonight. Okay, so we're going to be heading down past some of the bars and pubs area here. We've got Latifs coming up here on the right hand side. Again, beautiful decorations there. There's quite a few in Latifs. And Bridgefords has got a fabulous Christmas display. Just look at that inside of Bridgefords. What a great place to work, eh? They have certainly done well dressing up the windows. They look pretty awesome. So we're just passing hip hops. And the old Nat West Bank here, which is, is it 55, wine bar. Bank corner, that's Crew Road gone. Straight ahead of us is Lawton Road. So we're gonna cross over into there in a minute and uh, head a little bit further down there. Let's just check out this. Wow, look at this window. So this is headway, improving life after brain injury. This is awesome. Beautiful window display. I like that little train there at the bottom. Nice dress. Check the dress out. That dress is awesome. Look at that. Wow, really cool. So there's a bar right across the road there called The Junction. I've never been into any of these. A lot of them have got a lot of eatery places outside. Must be really good in the summer. And there's their Civic Centre and the beautiful Christmas tree. Okay, we're going to head back down Rosie's Refills. Flower Passion. Oh wow, look at this window display. People still actually inside there. Well that is a absolute awesome display. It's a really nice shot. Look at the window display there. Wow. And just check out the Christmas tree. Beautiful. Wall Street. Don't know if I quite like that dress. And that one's a, check that one out. A bit dark. Wall Street. Right in the middle of the street, you've got the decoration hanging across. And what a state this is. Look at this, the bank corner. This place used to be absolutely even. Now it's all boarded up. Doesn't look the, the best of uh, places to go. Beautiful window display. Looks like it's still open. Getting past the Turkish barbers. And we are Back at Wolfram House across the road there. Eh? 
and Astra and right across the road, and Wolfram House. I can't believe on the right used to be Oasis Travel, to the left was Grapevine. And Oasis Travel is where I used to work for 23 years as a travel agent. There we go guys, hope you've enjoyed this walk around All Sager tonight, another Vlogmas video, 11 days before Christmas. If you have enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up, drop me some comments and of course subscribe to the channel and we will see you on the next adventure soon and certainly if you want to join us on Sunday we are in London it's going to be busy spectacular amazing see you all soon Merry Christmas